Welcome to the Daily Guidance Meditation Podcast with the Realized Master. These meditation talks were recorded during intensive spiritual retreats with Sadhguru Siriya Ji. Therefore, they might contain some specific teachings and wisdom for life to be taken into consideration. Each recording begins with a mantra to bring you into a favorable condition for the inner journey. This initial mantra is followed by a brief talk in which the process of meditation is explained to you. After the talk, keep meditating at least for 15 minutes and if you like it, continue, increasing the time by and by as you proceed. So now you are left with nothing else to do but close your eyes, relax, listen and let meditation happen. Satna 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 Satnam Radasu Ami Radasu So Radha so I prostrate, I worship thee, I beg you to give me your darshan.
in your temple of ecstasy, in your temple of intoxication. The soul enjoys ineffable beatitude, the pain of separation is gone. In thy temple of Samadhi, in the temple of communion, the worshipper becomes one with the worship one. There is left no difference between the two. Now there is only love. Now there is only peace. The whirling of the mind is ended. Radha has become one with Swami. So this our body is the temple of God and it's in this temple that we enter, we prostrate and we worship Him. And we beg Him to give, it, to give us His darshan. Then, if by grace of God we have his darshan, we enter into the temple of ecstasy, into the temple of intoxication, and the pain of separation is just gone. Then we enter into the temple of Samadhi, in which we commune with the Supreme Being. So, we, the worshippers, dissolve into the worshipped one. And there is left no difference in between the two. So this is what we try to do when we sit in meditation. And we should sit with holy patience with good will and with longing. Longing for the beloved should never should never miss, should never lack. It must grow and grow because it is this longing that attracts the Beloved. So let us sit with this kind of longing, a sweet longing for God. Longing for union with the Beloved. And let's humbly pray that He be merciful and He may bless us.